Lose belly fat with only one meal a day. The one meal a day diet is an eating plan that claims to help people lose weight through intermittent fasting. When following this diet, you will eat only one meal a day, usually dinner. Are you one of the people who is already tired of having belly fat, looking for a way to lose it? Well, you should keep watching this video. In this video, we will learn more about losing belly fat with only one meal a day and what it means to eat one meal per day and find out more about the possible benefits and risks. Stay tuned for more. What is the one meal a day diet? The one meal a day diet is a weight loss plan in which a person eats only one meal per day. On this plan, they will not eat or drink anything containing calories for most of the day. It is a type of intermittent fasting. It alternates long periods without eating or drinking anything containing calories with short time windows for eating. The diet utilizes a type of intermittent fasting called 23-1. This means that a person spends 23 hours of the day fasting, leaving just one hour per day to consume calories. Most people who follow this diet eat their meal at dinner time, then fast again until the following evening. However, some research suggests that eating breakfast may aid glucose control later in the day and reduce the risk of type 2 diabetes. Other research contradicts these conclusions, suggesting that skipping breakfast may actually be a beneficial strategy for some people in managing overall calorie consumption. How it works There are many types of intermittent fasting practices and multiple ways to implement OMAD. Examples include having just one meal and fasting for the rest of the day, or having one meal and eating limited amounts of food during fasting periods. This type of diet creates a calorie deficit, which can lead to weight loss. Other health benefits related to fasting include the potential to reduce heart disease risk factors, decrease blood sugar, and reduce inflammation. However, compared to other fasting regimens, such as the 16-8 method, which involves 8-hour eating windows and 16-hour fasting windows, eating just one meal per day is one of the most extreme methods of intermittent fasting. A few popular diets encourage eating one meal per day. For example, when following the warrior diet, a person eats a single meal a day, cycling between long periods of fasting with short periods of energy consumption. Most people following OMAD choose to only consume dinner, although others choose breakfast or lunch as their one meal. Some versions of this eating pattern allow a snack or two in addition to one meal. However, some OMAD enthusiasts don't consume anything containing calories during their fasting window and only consume calories during their chosen meal, which typically lasts an hour or so. Foods to eat and avoid when you are on an OMAD diet. Number one, get enough protein. Since you are allowed to eat only one meal a day, you do not want to consume only calories and fat. Other nutrients are equally important. Try to include protein in your diet. The amino acid present in protein helps to build lean muscle. Try to include 0.7 to 1 gram per pound of lean body mass of protein. Eat animal-based food like meat, eggs, fish, chicken, organ meats, and cheese. Most of the nutrients required by our body can come from these sources, so your plate should contain these food items in a large quantity. Number two, healthy fats are also important. When on the OMAD diet, decrease your fat intake by 20 to 30 percent, but do not increase it further as it will downregulate your hormones and thyroid level. 100 to 180 grams of fat should be present in your diet to stay fit and healthy. Eggs, fish, avocado, olives, olive oil, coconut oil, MCT oil. Nuts and seeds are good when you are on the OMAD diet. Just make sure that you do not get involved in mindless eating. Overeating any food items can be harmful to your diet plan. Number three, vegetable and fermented foods. It's not only that animal products are good for your health, you must include veggies in your diet in equal proportion. Some veggies are good antioxidants and improve the gut microbiome. Include food items like broccoli, Swiss chard, and spinach in your diet. You can also have fermented foods like sauerkraut and kombucha as they contain good bacteria for your gut and stomach. Number four, carbohydrates. Sweet potatoes, white potatoes, rice, quinoa, carrots, beetroot, turnips are good sources of starch and can be included in your diet. Even in case of fruits, you must be mindful about the serving because an excess of fructose doesn't do the body good. Number five, herbs and spices. Nutrient-rich herbs and spices like dill, fennel seeds, coriander, and parsley are good to have when you are on the OMAD diet. They contain zero calories, but they provide micronutrients to your body. What you should avoid. Number one, avoid food during the fasting window. Do not consume any calories when fasting. You can only have tea or coffee. If your motto is only weight loss, then you can add some butter, MCT oil, and artificial sweeteners to your beverage. 
Doing this is not bad for your weight loss, but you won't be able to reap any benefit of autophagy, a natural regulated mechanism of the cell that removes unnecessary components from the body. Number two, inflammatory foods. Try not to eat refined carbohydrates, especially greens, processed meats, or trans fats. This can be harmful to your diet plan. Even food items like pastries, ice cream, and candy can make you feel lethargic the next day. Number three, allergenic foods. There are a lot of food items that can cause gastrointestinal stress, leading to a leaky gut, so you should strictly stay away from such food items. Do not consume gluten, soy, legumes, and lectins. Lose belly fat with only one meal a day. In order to lose weight, you must create an energy deficit. You can do this by either increasing the number of calories you burn or reducing your calorie intake. Calorie restriction, no matter how you achieve it, will lead to fat loss. People using the OMAD method are likely to lose weight simply because they are taking in fewer overall calories than they normally would during a regular pattern of eating. For example, a study in healthy adults found that restricting calorie intake to a four-hour time period in the evening led to significantly greater body fat loss than when eating three separate meals throughout the day. Research has also shown that intermittent fasting, including extended fasting periods like OMAD, is likely to result in weight loss. In addition to weight loss, research has linked fasting to a number of other health benefits. For example, fasting may help reduce blood sugar and certain heart disease risk factors, including LDL bad cholesterol. Fasting has also been associated with a reduction in markers of inflammation, including C-reactive protein. Additionally, eating only one meal a day may offer unique benefits for the health of the nervous system. It may slow neurodegeneration and promote longevity, according to animal research. Why eat only once a day? Most people cringe at the thought of missing a single meal. Intentionally missing all but one meal every day seems excessive and unnecessary, but proponents of OMAD claim a multitude of benefits, including number one, increased focus and productivity. Who hasn't hit that groggy 2.30 p.m. slump at the office? OMAD is said to eliminate the sluggishness people feel while digesting their lunch because there is no lunch. Number two, weight loss. It's extremely hard to be at a caloric surplus when you're eating one time per day. Even if your one meal is not healthy by normal standards, you're not taking in as many calories as you would if you were eating all day long. Number three, diet freedom. Forget logging calories or eating out of Tupperware. You free up a lot of mental energy when you don't have to plan four to six meals per day. Some follow this eating pattern for religious reasons but others, including prominent pro athletes like Ronda Rousey and Herschel Walker, voluntarily eat once a day for the long term. Walker claims to have been eating one meal a day, typically a salad and some bread in the evening for years. Have you tried fasting or eating one meal a day only before? Share your thoughts in the comments section. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. For more interesting facts on the human body, subscribe to the channel. Here are two more videos you should check out, both of them will definitely help you reach your goals.